Welcome to Old Bird Gaming. My name is Two, and I am the Old Bird. We are playing Valiant Hearts the Great War today. And this charming little game about war and death and doom. And I've actually heard it's rather depressing, this game. But that it's also real fun and that it has a really uh, in-depth story. And that it actually is uh, really historically correct. They show you things about uh, you know, what happened during World War One and some of the technologies that they used. And, uh, so, being somebody who actually likes to study old world wars, I thought this would be a great game to play. So, we're gonna play it, and, um, well, just as soon as I can get my shit together, there we go. Alright. Let's just get right into it. New game. We're gonna, game saves automatically at certain points. Okay. Well, heh. Goodness. Freely inspired by the events unfolding on the Western Front between August 1914 1st, and 1918. 1914. After oh. the assassination of Prince Franz Ferdinand of the Austro-Hungarian Empire, yeah, that's how it started. The German Empire declares war on Russia uh. because of established alliances. France is preparing for conflict. They skipped a lot a few of shit. Hours after the announcement but basically, of the yeah, that's what happened. German civilians living in France are asked to leave the country. Okay. Carl is one of them. Am I Carl? Is my name Carl? Ich bin Carl, ja? I don't know. I'm... Oh, here... You must leave the country. Oh, 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 oh. We have rolled up on our little faggy bicycles to tell you that you have to leave country. Oh, oh, oh. 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 But his wife is not going with okay so i guess he's like he's this must be a guy who moved from germany to france and set up and has a family and who okay who's this guy uh so now he has to abandon his family to go back to germany <clears throat> army de terre et, i don't know how to read i don't know anything about french et army de mer no. Okay, so who's this guy? Who's Mr. Beardy McBeardface? I don't know who Beardface is. He has a magic beard. This is the beard? Does he deliver mail? A few oh. days after Carl was deported, the war was hungry for more and took away a meal as well. Okay. A heavy hearted Emil was called up to fight. And left the farm for San Miel. Like okay. so many others, he had no idea what fate had in store for him. Okay, so uh, his the person that he knew <clears throat> that was that was that, is that his daughter? Is he was um, was Carl like married to his daughter, and now Carl's going off to the German side, and he's got to go off to the French side and fight. They have to fight each other? Hey! hey <laughs> nice little lance there, buddy! Are you frustrated? Are you constipated? Stop sticking your damn sword in my butt! I don't like that! I am not in the mood for such things! What is this? War is declared! June 28, 1914, Archduke Franz Ferdinand, heir to the- yes, was killed. Okay... A um, lot of historical stuff. The barracks and the regiment battalions compromise. This is gonna. There's gonna be a lot of stuff in here, isn't there? Um, we can, the outbreak of war. Each country was eager to dispatch its army as quickly as possible, and they used railways. This is true. The debacle of in the uh, early fighting, the German army made swift progress after invading Belgium. That's what started the whole thing. Invading Belgium, they marched on to Paris. Um. Now, I don't know if I'm going to read all this stuff, because there, it seems like there might be a lot of it. Oh, wow, that was fast. I now have my uniform. Oh. Horn. You, you want a horn? Am I supposed to horn? Or are... Oh, you're supposed to horn. Okay. You horned. Bah! Yeah. What? What? Okay. 
You horned, so we're off. All right. Oh, yeah, get up there, fatty. Boy, it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. I am the best soldier ever. Wait. Okay. Okay. Oh, I see how we go. I see how we do. Boog it. Blow that. That's a long grenade fuse, dude. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, what? Wait, what's this? Oh, I got a thing. Oh, okay. So you can pick up stuff too. You can collect things. German, the legendary German pointed German helmet. Um, the Pickelhaube was used by German forces until 1916. It was replaced with much more efficient steel helmets. I uh, heard actually the reason that they stopped using it. They, they figured that in like a, a really dodgy situation, you could take your helmet off your head and use it to stab with, and that was the whole idea. But instead, all it did was it actually showed the position of the German soldiers in the trenches to the enemy because those little things would bob up and down over over the trenches and so they started taking them off um i i think that's what happened bug it bug it okay okay oh we have to make a little strategery shot here to, okay oh bonk oh you've had it dummy straw dummy you've had it that's your ass i'm really good at destroying straw dummies I'm gonna be the best soldier ever! What do you want? Up. Uh, okay. You know that? I wonder what that would be like to, you know, because there were times like that when it's like, guess what? Country's being invaded now. Here's your uniform. Here's your training. Get the fuck out there and shoot people. That would have to be really, really tough. Oh, oh okay. Ah! Oh. Viva la France! Okay. My dear Marie, we are on our way to Paris. The atmosphere here is strangely cheerful. I hope that the harvest goes well. Rely on our neighbors for help. They've always been gracious and charitable people. I'll hmm. write again as soon as I get my assignment. Please kiss my little grandson for me. I bet your assignment is going to be to go to Germany. I bet you it is. At the train depot in Paris, trying to reach his regiment at Platform 21, Emile would meet the man he would soon fight alongside. The man who would come to be his truest friend. Hey. Why are you picking on this dude? Hey, don't stop me. Why are you picking on dudes through there? What'd he do? You know, he does not look like a guy that you would want to pick on. That looks like a really big guy. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm helping. I'm helping. I'm helping. Uh. Now what? How do I get rid of these other guys? Because they won't let me in. There's another pipe that goes. Oh, the conductor's up there. Okay, how do I get the conductor to pull that thing? Hey, conductor. What do you want? Conductor. Oop, that didn't work. Can I just... Can I just throw bottles at these fuckers? Hey, assholes. Splat. Okay, that didn't work. Uh... But I have infinite... Infinite wine... See? This is definitely a box that Kage would want. Infinite wine bottles. I can have as many of them as I want. What do you want? What? I'm be now. Oh, he wants white wine. Of course you do. You're French. All the French love white wine, which is not real wine, by the way. Are you okay? Not wine at all. Some unholy beverage from devil's ass. Uh, yeah, you have fun with that. Oh! Okay, now I can go back. Cool! New diary unlocked. Diaries. Oh, there's a lot of... Okay. August 12th, 1914. I started training in a military camp today. I can't start up. I can't help thinking of Carl, who's probably doing the same in Germany. Declaration of a war has created havoc. I hope Marie and the neighbors manage to finish the harvest in time. Who's this? That's that dude. That's that dude they're picking on over there. 
August 12th, 1940. At last, I can't wait to get fighting. Maybe it'll ease some of the pain I feel inside. Who is that? I don't even know who that is. The bells all over Paris started chiming at 4 p.m. this afternoon. It was Eri! Somebody on the street told me it was for troop mobilization in case Germany declares war. I'll write to Father to find out what's going on in Belgium. All right. Oh, Carl! August 1st. Feels strange to return to Germany. At least Emil can take care of Marie and Victor. No, he can't. You have no idea. He's been shipped off to war, do you? Things should calm down in the months to come. It's also meaningless. You know, very often, that's exactly what war is. It's completely meaningless. Okay, there's, um... There's a meal, right? After Carl, it's daddy's turn to leave. Why did they have to call on him? Wasn't it enough to expel my dear sweet love from these lands? Why did they put daddy in uniform? He's too old to fight, and now they've left me all alone with the harvest on the way and Victor to take care of. Har that's hard times. And I'm sure things like that actually really did... <clears throat> Who are you to tell me I can't climb the l I can't climb the ladder, but you love music. Those are two things to let me in on, aren't they? Okay, have some music. Okay. Do you have to do this in order? Oh, you do! Okay. Bend! Full bend! Oh, goody. Okay, now I can get up here. Oh, now I can go over there and bonk the conductor over the head and pull that thing for him. Oh, I don't have to. He just left. Ha. Ah, okay. Okay, other mean guys who are picking on people. Oh, I love the comic style. That's so cool. All right. Hey, buddy. You okay? Don't like people picking on you? Yeah, Thank man, some people suck, dude. I'm Freddy. Where are you from? Freddy, did he say? Who is he? Oh, okay, an American. So we have a guy, we have German, and a guy from France, uh -huh, and August an American. August 21st, 1914. Emil's regiment was sent to fight against the 71st German Division, led by Baron von Dorf. The general cheer of the first hours dissipated into the fear of first combat. Yeah, okay. Okay, here we go. Are we going to fight? Is this just my job, is carrying the flag? Is that all I have to do? Can't I shoot someone? I love that little trotty. Look at that. Trot, 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 trot. That's such a faggy walk, dude. <laughs> okay, okay, oh, oh. Charge! All right! Whoa, now, wait a minute, there's, um, wait a minute. Hang on, I didn't know there was gonna be bullets. Um, th this is, oh! Okay, this is not cool. I didn't know they were gonna shoot at us. That's not fair. I'm supposed to shoot at people during war? I don't want to be shot. I'm just, uh, hey, I'm just carrying the flag. That's all I'm doing. I'm in Oh, okay, you just got your ass handed to you. Don't, no, 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 no bullets. No bullets. I don't need to be shot. Oh, damn. They're really trying to kick my ass. Go, man! Keep running, even, wow, everybody's getting killed. Holy shit. Ah, everybody's dying. Oh, I, oh, I almost, oh, shit. Jesus, everybody, everybody's getting their ass kicked. I mean, am I the only one left? No, no. I got my ass kicked too. All right. Oh, but it looks like it's a part of it. Okay. Oh. Well, that was a... That was a short fight. Kind of expected to get on longer than that. Is that... Oh, hey, Carl! Emil. Miss Marie Chayon. <clears throat> Private Emile Chayon, from the 150th Infantry Regiment, was wounded by enemy fire on August 21st. Okay. He has been oh. captured by the enemy. Oh. Hopefully, you shall receive news from him soon. Well, luckily, he was found by Carl. Maybe now they Freddy, just won't kill him. Originally from America... 
enlisted voluntarily in the French forces at the Why? start of the war. Why would you do? Behind Why? his bravery hid a man already devastated by the war's effects. A oh. man with one sole obsession. Punish those who had destroyed his life. What'd they do to destroy his life, though? That's what I want to know. Did they do- It was at the Battle of the Marne that Freddy finally picked up the trail of the regiment commanded by Baron Von Dorf. Ugh. Damn you, Von Dorf. Damn you, Baron Von Dorf. So what do I do? I... Do that. I gotta blow s oh, I can't get through here. Okay, I need to blow up- Oh, wait a minute. Oh! Okay, I've got- I've got things! I've got little clampy things, that's cool. Um... But, oh! I like him! Freddy Smash! Let's see, uh... Got a diary from him. August 20, we spent yet another, yet another day walking. Heard cannon fire for the first time today. I don't want to have to kill, I must stop thinking about it and get some sleep. That's the day before he got... Uh, captured, isn't it? August 24th, the letter gave me such a fright. Poor daddy, he's been wounded, taken prisoner by the Germans. I don't know if he'll be seri if he's seriously injured or if he's be being take uh, well taken care of. I've been told prisoners are allowed to receive letters. I shall write him tomorrow. That's awfully kind, uh, I guess, of the, of the Germans to actually let prisoners of war receive letters. I guess they were completely barbaric. Uh, okay, I... Did you just die? Did your head just get blown off? Um... Oh! I thought I was gonna... Oh. That was totally accident. I thought, I thought it was, I thought it was gonna throw it, it was gonna roll down that wagon and blow something up on the other side, I guess... I guess that's what I was supposed to do. <laughs> okay, blow up a bridge. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. Thank you, sir. May I have another? Blowing up a bridge. That's what I'm best at. Haven't you heard? I'm Freddy Blow Up the Bridge Dude. Um. That does not. Why did you just sit there and get shot like that? Okay. Okay, so you. Let me guess. I'm guessing you have to have a bunch of reload time. Uh huh. Well, it's not gonna matter because you're going down, bitch. Oh, bug it! Oh shit, that may not work. I may not have got it close enough. Okay, try that. Ah, there you go. Eat that, Buster. No? Um. Okay. Well, what's with the ladder? Hang on. Can I? Uh... Oh, is this gonna? Okay. Dun 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 dun. dun. Okay, now I can run over here while you're being a dumbass and loading. Uh, let's see here. Brick. Oh, can I brick you? I'm totally gonna brick you right on the top of your brain. Bonk. Ah! Oh. Um. That didn't seem to impress him much. Do I just have to keep bonking you until you get a concussion and fall down and can't remember your children? What? Um. Have to do something else. Maybe they're for distracting. Ah, they're for distracting. Okay. Down we go. Uh, now what? There's water. I can't go in the water. I guess I can't swim. Uh, Diamondite. What do I do with Diamondite? Uh. Oh, I see. Do I put the diamondite there? I do put the diamondite there. Goodbye, bridge! Later, bitches! Boom! Explosions! All right. Oh, what happened? Uh, Battle of the, Mar Battle of the Marne. Grown up long before the war. Yeah, okay. Uh, what's this? Americans in the French army. 128 American soldier Americans enrolled in the French army from the start of the conflict, mostly in Paris. Huh. Machine guns. 
Great War demonstrated the technical progress of the age by, yeah, with the machine gun, which was the first thing. Flags were powerful symbols for each unit. They were. Flags used to mean a lot more. I mean, actually carrying the flag in battle meant it was like a pride thing that, that people would get shot over and killed just carrying the flag. So, yeah. I'm going to grab one of these just, just in case I need one. I mean, they're right there, right? Might as well. Uh, okay. What do we do? We go over here and we can't jump. There is no jumping. Um, can I... Well, that's not gonna do... Gonna do shit, is it? Um... Oh, maybe if I toss that and then this... Oops. I don't think that's gonna do it either. No, I need to hit... I need to hit... Ah! I need to hit the dynamite I threw down there. Hang on. Uh, no! Oh, wait a minute, there's a box of dynamite! God. That was there the whole time, was it? I'm so stupid. I'm, a, I'm an idiot. Boom! There was some boom! Oh, cool. Oh, hey, and I could still pick up my dynamite. Huh, in case I need it. Um... Um... Well, ha! Huh. I kind of suspected as much. Let's see here... Don't, don't go back down the ladder. Okay, so... Oh! Uh -oh. We have another shashin gun. Um... And it doesn't like me. Oh! Okay, and then he... Has to reload. This is cool! I like, I like the little comic window where... You can see what's going on. Okay, so... I gotta stay here... And then when he quits shooting... I gotta do this. Clippity clip, 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 hurry up, clip, clip. Okay, run, 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 run. Fuck me. Okay. Oh, uh, you're done now. I've got grenades. Granada! Is the. Boom! Oh, okay. I'll throw another one. Oh, bogey! Oh, right down in your. Oh, right on your crotch. No, don't run away. Stay there and get blown up. Okay. You can't stop me. Uh, another machine gun over here. Do I have to stop it? Oh. Uh, um, smash! Hulk smash! Uh, yes! Holy shit! He has a Zeppelin! Uh oh. Alright, big guy with your hat and your nipples. Let's get going. Whoa! Oh, shit. I don't think I'm coming back out this way, am I? Barrels? Why do you have the barrels? These are the barrels that they've been trying to hide during the war. Damn you Germans and your barrel-stealing ways! I will unsteal your barrels! I will... I will get a... I will get a wine bottle. And I will... How is this gonna help me unsteal barrels? I don't know. I'll figure it out, though. <laughs> okay, I don't... I don't think I should... Can I bonk you? Is there any way I can bonk you? I would love to bonk you. I mean, I could... If I can bonk down, like, wooden debris, then surely I can bonk you, right? I'm gonna go try and bonk you. See if it gets me killed. It might... Bonk you! Oh, <laughs> Nice! Okay. Oh, what are this? Eggplants and tomatoes. And other things. Well, that's- those aren't weapons, those are noms! I'm supposed to nom that shit. Uh, I don't think. I don't think I can get up here. No, I cannot. Because... Douche McTiddington over there is standing on the- Well, this bell- Long- Alright, now I'm coming up here. And Kerbonk! <laughs> oh, Kerbonk! Yeah! Oh, goody. Oh! Yes! I've won the war! Thanks to support from British All by forces, myself. the German plan failed. The front line moved back to the north, and with the arrival of winter, 
froze. Ew. Soldiers holed up amid a vast labyrinth of trenches and tunnels. Oh, that yeah. That would become the indelible image of the Great War. And if you go on Google Earth, you can still see those trenches, Carl's too. Carl's regiment there. retreated to the outskirts of New Chapelle, the same camp where Emile was being held prisoner. Oh. Okay. Uh, oh. Now see that right there? That's how to fight a war in style. Beer. And, and, oh, they want noms. Wait, did that guy have a big pretzel? He does. He has a huge pretzel. And that guy has a sausage. Sausages. We want sausages. I want to get the sausages. I will totally... We will have all the sausages. Oh, what is this? Six million prisoners of war between 1914 and 1918. Uh, including 1.2 million German and 200,000 British troops. There were German prisoners of war in Germany? Okay. Uh, letters remain the only real means of communication with the outside world. Uh, the, the shells literally rained down on German forces at that battle. The Garwal rifles. Uh, in early 20th century, Great Britain and France governed huge colonial empires and then put them to use during the war. Mud. Trench life was difficult. They had mud. There's mud everywhere. I could get girls in there and just do it, watch them do mud wrestling. There's a lot, there's a thousand and one things you can do with mud. I know, I read the book, A Thousand and One Things You Can Do With Mud. Explosives, trench fortifications required the use of explosives. Yes, they did. So we got mud and explosions. This is a, this is a cocktail for some serious war going on. Explosions and mud. Okay, so you want me to water the dog. Okay, I'll water the dog. Watering the dog. Nom 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 nom. Okay. Don't bark at me, bitch. I just watered you. Okay, so there's a handle and a thingy and a... I can't... I can't do anything with them. They are useless! Things like this should not be decorations! Uh... Oh, there's a the thing. Oh, another collectible. What be this? Photo frame. Even though photography was not widespread, many soldiers had their photos taken before setting out for the war. Okay. Um... A. A. Okay. Pot. Oh. Oh, hey! Carl! It's Carl! Carl! Uh, yeah. Can you save me now? Can you make me- can you get me out of here? Can you sneak me out of here and without Dear getting shot? Papa, we live in a climate of uncertainty. Germans use the people of Saint Miel as human shields against the French bombings. Yeah. I hope the Germans treat you well and that your wound has healed. Your grandson sends you kisses. I sent you a picture of him. All my love. Please write soon. Okay, great, Carl. Now get me out of here. Before drunking my drunkington over there. Oh, oh, Carl! Carl, I thought we were friends, bruh! What the hell, man? You're supposed to help me dig a tunnel and get me out of this place. I would prefer not to be a prisoner of war, please. Thank you. I don't like that. Om nom nom nom! I know, om noms. What the? Why did that drain the water? Oh, there's a, oh, there's a, there's a order you have to do it in. In the worst house. Es ist dein worst house. Yeah. Ich liebe das worst house. Okay. Now, sausages. I have found the sausages. They were right here the whole time. All right. Sausage soup coming up, guys. I hope you like it. Uh, oh, those are French cannons. They're going to bomb us. I don't think that's good. That's not good at all. I'm gonna get inside. Fuck you guys, I'm not fighting this. That's my people bombing your asses. Ooh. Hello. Medical puppy! Hi, medical puppy! Uh... 
I have been saved by medical puppy. You are the best medical puppy in the world. The first house is blown up. I don't like this. Medical puppy, your name is Shati. Yes, I'm going to call you Shati. Um. Oh, bug it, bug it, bug it, bug it, spoon! I'm gonna spoon that shit. Oh, um. Okay, uh, oh, I can't. Can I, can I pull this guy? Dragging. Where's Carl? He's in the blimp, damn it. Uh oh. Oh shit, is he flying the blimp? Alright, give me a wine bottle. I don't know why I need it, but it's there, so I figure I need it. Uh. Uh. Okay, uh. Oh, there's a thing in the tree over there. I w can I just blow this up? Okay, that won't be- I can't blow it up. But this has got to be here for a reason, so... And I hate wasting wine like- It breaks my goddamn heart to waste wine like this. Believe me! You're not supposed to treat wine in this manner. But I'm doing it anyway. I'm sorry. Apologize to everybody. Especially Kage, because I know he- What? I know he wouldn't like that. Even though it is red wine. Okay, go pick up the thing. What is that thing? Is that a, like a club or a night sticker? Or is it just, um... That's just a handle for this thing. Okay. Whoa! There we go! Yay! Shotzi's happy, I'm happy, we're all happy. Alrighty. Okay, oh... This looks like... Oh, Lord. Can I grab this? I bet I can. Yeah, I can. And this... This is a puzzle! It's totally a puzzle. You know what, I'm gonna solve this puzzle in the next episode, though, but... By the way, I just wanted to say, guys, um... This is the first recording I've made since I got back... ...from, uh, my trip to Seattle, so... I'm officially back now, and, uh, we're gonna continue on with this... ...and everything else, and, uh, the channel's good. We're gonna have more videos for you guys, and I hope you enjoy them. It's good to be back, I'll be able to talk to you guys again on the comments. And, uh, which, by the way... Leave some! And don't forget to click the like, and subscribe to my face. We will meet again in the next emanation. Until then!